importance of that result last time out? What did, what did that do for you mentally? You keep your job, you know, so that's, a, that's the biggest thing, you know. That's a, a fight where you know going in as a fighter kind of where you stand and with the company and you know when it's a must win and that was obviously a must win. So uh, get out of there with a W, get some momentum finally going on my side and now uh, kind of keep the ball rolling. I kind of wonder, I mean, this game is so mental, right? It is about confidence, that sort of thing. Yeah. But when you go 0-2, I mean, the self-doubt start creeping in a little bit. Do you, do you have to battle that? Yeah, I mean, I'm a, I'm a self-confident guy. Uh, I've won my whole career, you know, so I know, I know what I'm capable of. So it never was, like, real bad, but it does – it messes with you, man. Losing sucks. I fucking hate losing. Like, so uh, that's the biggest thing. I was just, it just made me more hungry, I guess, to get that, that first W in the UFC. But, uh, yeah, it was shitty for a little bit. <laughs> And then you get this this call to come out. I wonder. I mean, you just did Argentina. Mm -hmm. When they say now we want you to go to Australia. I mean, did that did that give me a pause to say let me fight back home, or do you kind of like the idea of getting on the road? Yeah, it's cool. I mean, it, I mean, it's a cool job because you get to experience so much part of the world with that. You know, most jobs you're not gonna be able to do that. So it's cool. I would like to be fighting. Hopefully, the next one I'm gonna get in the states. Uh, but they gave me the opponent, and it, it, I just loved the matchup so much. I was like, oh man, we, we're going to Australia, baby. Let's do this. Very nice. <laughs> And I saw too the social media posts you had about 19 year old yeah. watching Anderson Silva. Yeah. The Vitor Belt that was crazy, fight. huh? So, I mean, did you know that when you got this coming in, or did you? Really no, I yeah. So I saw uh, on Twitter the MMA history page thing uh, popped up the Anderson Silva, and I was like, I was at that fight. So I went back to my pictures, pulled it up, and yeah. So February 5th, that was me and my girlfriend. Then we're. Uh, Went to watch a fight when I was 19, and now I'm fighting on the same card as you know one of the greatest of all time. So it's pretty surreal. Does that add? I mean, does it make it feel pretty special? Yeah, it does. It, I didn't even realize, like I said, I didn't realize it going in, but now it's like, man, this is it's pretty awesome. It's pretty cool stuff happening. Talk about the matchup. You said it was the matchup that excited mm -hmm. you as much as anything. What, what is it about? Yeah, I just see uh, he's a he's a good tough fighter. You know, he moves forward. Uh, he's active, which I like. Um, he's gonna push the pace and. Uh, I like where my strengths match up with his. I think uh, my speed is going to be a big, big advantage for me, and I, I just see uh, my style really going to come to shine in this fight, and it's going to be a real exciting fight where I can uh, hopefully get a finish as well. Last thing for me, I mean, what is the goal? Like you said, you got that first step behind mm -hmm. you, right? Like that's important. So, what's what's the goals now in your career? Yeah, so kind of I've been talking about a checklist. You know, first it was getting the UFC. The next goal is get the first win. Right now, my my next goal is get the first finish. I want to get a big finish, make a statement, get two wins in a row, which is hard to do in this company. Get back to back wins and really get momentum going. Uh, so, looking to get that first finish and uh, really really start pushing hard after this. Yeah. Who do you, who do you see in the, um, the co-main event winning? Oh man, I've been talking to everybody about that fight. That's such an awesome fight. Um, Adesanya is a freak, man. His his striking is like another level. But uh, I'm kind of pulling for Anderson, just like the kid in me watching him grow up, man. It's just I'd love to see him pull it off. But uh, if I'm picking with my head, I'm I'm going with Adesanya. But I hope Anderson can do it. And for the and for the main event, who do you have? That's got another awesome fight. That one's badass too. Uh, leaning towards Whitaker, uh, I think. I, I just, what he did to Yoel Romero, being able to beat that man twice is incredible. So uh, I lean in towards Whitaker, but Kelvin's tough, man. I wouldn't be surprised if he got it done. You had a chance to look around, Melvin? Not much, man. I'm kind of a, I just kind of hide away during fight weeks, you know. I, I go, I do my training in the morning, get my meals, whatever, do my training in the afternoon. I just kind of sit back uh, and I don't go too much sightseeing. I just really get focused, laser, laser focus on the fight. Um, and I, I, I don't know, I just don't like to get too caught up into other stuff. I like to really stay focused on what my job is here. I'm not here on vacation. I'm here to take care of business. So uh, I haven't been able to. It's beautiful, but uh, I haven't been able to experience too much of it.